Okay, this is a quick video showing how to make a, a background display statically um, in Kartra. So what I'm going to do, I've got this little demo page here and I'm setting it up so that this background of the Golden Gate Bridge here will stay fixed as the, uh, the, the page scrolls up and down. Uh, it's not going to show properly um, in the page builder because of the way uh, the page builder lays out the sections, but it will show um, it is a fixed uh, placement background in the actual uh, page uh, or in a preview. So first of all, we need to have the um, the page, the HTML ID for this section. There are a couple of ways you can do that. You can create um, a button. It, it doesn't have to be uh, part of your actual finished page. It can be a button you just temporarily create um, that links to the section. So I've, I've turned this uh, content button into a, a jump to section button. So if you look in the lower left hand corner, you'll see a URL. Currently it's the page builder URL, but the, the part of interest is the part that's after the pound sign, that underscore F2 uh, stuff. Um, so this is um, just a scroll to a particular section. This is section two. So I said, uh, make this a jump to section two button. Um, so that's one way to grab the, um, the ID that after the hashtag part there. Um, so I could say copy link address. Um, and if I paste that into a notepad, um, this, this part right here um, is, is going to be the ID for the section. Um, I can also do um, a right click on the background and say inspect in my browser. So the, what we're going to change is um, how this background here displays. What we need to do is go up to the iframe that displays uh, the, this section in the page builder. So here again is uh, our ID tag, so you can copy that. So that's another way. Uh, so either the button or the uh, page inspector to get the ID. And then you will come into the page styles section and you will say pound sign and that ID uh, and then a space. And then we need to change the, the div uh, that has the, um, the background display in it, which is going to be uh, with a class of background underscore changer. So we're going to have pound sign and our ID, a space, a period, background underscore changer, and I'll, I'll include the, the code for this um, in, under the, in the description for this video. Um, but basically you'll have to put in the ID part. And then you'll have uh, an open brace, the curly brace sometimes called, and then you'll have background dash attachment colon fixed semicolon and close brace and then you'll apply that style and then save your page and when you preview or publish the page you'll end up with this result and you'll see if I scroll this the Golden Gate Bridge doesn't move while I scroll the page up and down.